Continuing on in course one of Code Studio, we are going to talk about the unplugged lesson Getting Loopy. Getting Loopy, Loopy. Getting Loopy teaches about loops. This is less about teaching what a loop is. Students are really good at picking up on the idea of repetition and doing something over and over again. Uh, so this is less about the concept of a loop and more about connecting the words repeat and loop because we're going to need that later in the online lessons. To do that, we're going to have a dance party. The students are going to do a dance called the iteration. The iteration is nothing that really existed before this. Uh, it was created solely to uh, give us a reason to repeat. Uh, you can do this with dances like the Macarena or the Electric Slide if your class is a little more advanced, but the iteration is a really good play on words that someday they'll get it, but probably not in kindergarten. At any rate, we're going to teach them the iteration. So the iteration starts with a series of clapping, and then you put your hands on your head and on your waist, uh, clap again, and then you've got your right up, left up, right up, left up, clap again, and then it goes through that three times. And after they've gone through that, then they get a nice big belly laugh. The students really like that. Really like that. The students get to go through, they get to learn the dance, and once they learn that dance, they get a look at it and see if they can figure out where the loops are. There's one really obvious one in that you do a whole series three times before you move on to the belly laugh. But then there are a couple more obscure loops in there that the students are eventually able to find. And that ends up being the wrap-up worksheet for the entire lesson.